Thank you. Well, 2015 is here, and maybe you'd like to start the new year with a new look. Joining me this morning to go over some of the season's hottest hair trends is George Nikolai from Six Salon in Royal Oak and Birmingham. Thanks so much for uh, coming in early this morning for Thank us. Thank you for having me. I'll All right, start so talk early. about yeah, exactly. Let's talk about uh, hair trends. What are you hearing from from customers? What they want to see and what's popular right now? We're doing a little bit of everything, but uh, I like a little bit more of the lived-in hair. The new, the the new word we're hearing all the time right now is the cool look, cool, simple, a little bit cooler, softer tone, not as warm. Okay, you've got some pictures for us. Mm -hmm. So let's start with what you're calling uh, '90s. '90s, um, a little bit more effortless. We're trying to grow that color out through the crown, a little softer around the uh, face. Mm -hmm. The models are all having a little bit more color around their face. But it's simpler. It looks a little bit more lived in. So you say it's effortless, but even that takes some effort. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> okay, what else do you have? Um, the, I'm sorry, the That's baby lights. Baby the baby lights. lights. We're we're seeing clients come in and saying, I don't want it to be too thick around my crown. I'm trying to grow this out. So we're doing something called baby lights. It's a lot softer mm -hmm. around the crown. It grows out a little easier. But again, if you're looking at Every one of the ladies on TV right now, it's a lot softer with their eye color. It's a little cooler, not as much warmth. Okay, and probably not as drastic though when when it starts to kind of go away. I mean, as it's growing out, we don't want to see a line. We want it to see it. If you can't come in in four weeks, it's okay. We want it to slowly fade itself out. All right, you've got something else. Soft coppers. I love soft coppers. I love colors that have a little bit more of a lived-in look. Simple. Um, I don't like to see too much of the of the copper, more of a cooler tone mm -hmm. without it being too brassy. Okay. You've got something else? Cool kids. Cool kids. <laughs> you know, we get clients that do come in and say, Have you seen Kelly Osborne? Have you seen the colors that they're doing? We do have clients that come in and say, I want that faded purple. I want that really bright pink. Does it work? It absolutely works for some people. Some people mm -hmm. can carry it off really easy. That nice soft milky skin that uh one of the young ladies has on TV. It looks great on her. Okay. Now, you're talking about uh, hair color, and you've got a new location that you're doing something pretty unique here. We just opened up a new location about four or five weeks ago called Dye and Dash. <laughs> For the woman who doesn't have the time to come into our salons, uh -huh. something quick, easy. I'm trying to keep clients away from uh, the box. <laughs> doing it in the <laughs> doing kitchen. Doing it in the kitchen or the bathroom. Doing it in the bathroom. <laughs> yeah. uh, Dye and Dash is simple color. Just color, That's no it. hair cutting, no Couldn't blow get drying. Your there, just Nothing. Your hair we cut. don't even have scissors other than maybe to cut ah, paper. Okay. And why do you want to do that? I want to do that because I was seeing too much bad hair out there. <laughs> okay. Bad color. <laughs> bad color out there. I, I just wanted to give someone great color, a blendable color, a customized color for a woman who doesn't have the time to come in the salon and spend a couple of hours. Okay, and you said it's on Rochester Road? Right on, in Troy, right on Rochester okay. Road. So you can go there, die and dash, and then you can go to Six Salon in uh, Thank, Birmingham or Royal Oak and get a cut there if you really Thank want you. to. Thank you, yes, yes, All right, please. George, thanks so much for coming in this morning. Thank you. New this morning, a couple from Washington.